For more than 200 years, people have been treated at Glasgow's Royal Infirmary. And now a new exhibition showcases how work done here changed the course of medical history around the world. The hospital has such a rich history and we thought it was important that that was not forgotten and it was shared with not only the people that work here but with the whole Glasgow community because it has such huge implications worldwide in terms of the things that have happened in the Royal Infirmary. And not forgetting the people who worked here. Well, this rather distinguished looking gentleman is Joseph Lister. His research into wound infections led to the introduction of antisepsis and began the practice of sterilising surgical equipment, making operations far safer for patients and distinguishing him as the father of modern surgery. The infirmary was also home to the first x-ray department, thanks to John McIntyre and was the workplace of Rebecca Strong, a pupil of Florence Nightingale who pioneered professional nursing. And this was the moment it was officially opened. <laughs> by none other than Rebecca's great-grandson. This has been such an amazing day because it's been so long in the making to get this museum up and running. Our staff are, have been having a really difficult time obviously the last few years and I think for them to feel that they belong to something so special makes them come to work and feel proud to be part of the Royal Infirmary. Stories and exhibits will continue to be added to the museum so that the infirmary's significance in history is never forgotten. Caroline Lewis, STV News.